Hi, in this video I'm looking at calculating the volume of these two triangular prisms. We can see that they're triangular prisms because they have this triangle shape at the front and that extends all the way to the same triangle shape at the back. So this triangle is the base of this prism. Same here, we have this right angle triangle extends all the way through to this right angle triangle meaning that this is the base of these prisms. Now the volume of any prism can be calculated by doing area times height, the area of the base times height. So if I look at my first one, the area is this triangle at the front here that I want to look at. So our area, which for a triangle is base times height divided by two, and I'm just looking at this triangle which has a base of eight centimeters and a perpendicular height of seven centimeters. So I'm going to have a base of 8 times height of 7 divided by 2 and working that out gives us a base area of 28 centimeters squared. The volume is that area times by the height. So we're going to have 28 multiplied by our height which is this 10 centimeters. It might be lying down but it's still technically height because it's the dimension, the length that extends this triangle through to the far side. So we're going to multiply by 10 and so our volume is 280 centimeters cubed. Doing the same for the other one, our area is this right angle triangle at the front here. So we're still going to do base height divided by 2 and we're looking at this triangle which has a base of 6 millimeters and a perpendicular height of 8 because the right angle has the height given to us. So we're going to do 6 to multiply by 8 divided by 2 which gives us a base area of 24 millimeters squared. We then need to go to our volume rule which is area times by height which means that we're going to take this 24 and we're going to multiply by the height which in this case is the 12 millimeters. So we're going to multiply by 12. So our volume of our second triangular prism is 288 millimeters squared. And that's it, that's all we have to do. So the volume of any prism is area times height. We are triangles, so we work out the area of the triangle, multiply by height, and we're done.